back to my channel welcome back to my channel i'm very grateful if you are new here please do not forget to hit the subscribe button and if you're returning thank you do not forget to hit the like button and also drop a comment in the comment section and today we are going to be talking about something new something which helped me to boost my hair growth i started with deep conditioning and banana was one of my favorite because it is very cheap and affordable and you can see it everywhere so i would like to show you how i started my hair journey just with some type of deep conditioners which also boosts my hair growth and in the description box i'm going to put down the ingredients and the procedures on how you can be able to obtain your own hair mask and it is very essential for your hair because it adds nutrients it adds moisture it adds shine it stops dandruff guys it stops itchy scalp that if you are suffering from dandruff and at the same time you have this issue of always going in there with your finger going in there with the pen going there with the comb to scratch or to itch someplace guys just do this for one month and give me results just do this for one month and come back and tell me how you feel and sometimes even right instantly you get results so you're going to be seeing what i did or how i applied it sorry i did not do um i was not able to capture the procedure on how i normally go in with a blender and also to strain it out but that's not a big deal i'm going to describe it down there in the description box for you so you can follow and also do the same one of the things that we also neglect with our kind of hair is the fact that we do not practice deep conditioning. We do not practice to deep to do um, um, a hair care routine through deep conditioning. We do not practice that, and that's the reason why we also experience uh, uh, we also experience dryness in our hair. We also experience itchy scalp and dandruff and other things that damage our hair and it's not healthy so it is very important i think it is very important to to always um, do a hair mask for your hair at least once a week at least once a week to rejuvenate to bring back that moisture into your hair because things around the surrounding that causes our hair to be dry and it is susceptible to breakage when the hair becomes very brittle because it is dry so i would like to introduce this to you include it into your routine and believe me without oils without avocado oil without uh supplements you can still make your hair grow if you if you're able to consistently do this activity if you're able to do this routine at least once a week there are so many and so many varieties of deep conditioning which you can you can research and you can implement as well as as for me i always alternate i don't use the same deep conditioner or the same kind of deep conditioner on my hair every week i always change it i always change it so this week was banana and honey as my main ingredients to add moisture and to add some some shine to my hair and to make it you know easy for me to manipulate throughout the week and next week i could try another one and the other week and the other week another week and bang the last week of the month i usually go in with a very heavy kind of treatment which i am also going to teach you i'm also going to bring to you through this channel so 
I will be waiting for your reviews. I will be waiting for your comments on what or how you felt when you did this treatment because I feel also my hair is so super soft and very easy to manipulate, very easy to style because I already understand how to manage my hair and I want you to understand how to manage your hair and I also want you to grow healthy hair through deep conditioning yes 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 okay and just a reminder my hair is just one year old I started this journey in the year 2020 early 2020 and this is 2022 and I'm so excited with the things I have in mind the the the, the way I envision you know I did not literally just jump into natural hair but certain circumstances pushed me to get into this into this uh into this kind of routine and along the line i became so passionate about hair care and natural hair and discovered how easy how easy it is to keep your natural hair without pain without uh sound regular without break the on without breakage and you know it's very easy if you understand how your hair functions because not every hair is the same not every hair has the same texture you could have coarse hair that's um, like the same French so you might have the kind of uh, 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 hair which is really fine but it doesn't mean that your hair is unhealthy your hair could still be healthy and still fine but you also have other people who have very big grains and you see it you know you feel like ah this guy or this girl is really doing something special about her hair but there's nothing too special if you follow what I tell you if you follow and you practice my routine okay so let's get right into what i want to tell you and what i want to show you today which is very very healthy it is very it is it is so packed with nutrients and today we are going to be looking at banana banana is very very healthy for your hair guys and uh on my list here i have bananas i also have honey I also have my essential oils. I also have aloe vera. I also have a little bit of glycerin. Yes, you can use glycerin in your hair. It adds shine and moisture. You know, it's so, and it brings out that luxury look on your hair so if you're experiencing dryness with your hair then I think this treatment could just be the best option for you and I'd like you to try it out this week and get back to me and tell me how it was tell me how your result or tell me how you felt when you use this treatment so what am I going to do now I'm going to to get the bananas i'm going to get the honey i'm going to get the aloe vera gel and the glycerin and my essential oils i put them all together in the blender and i blend that up sorry i do not have a picture or a video about um, how i managed to blend it and extract the pulp because bananas sometimes sometimes keeps those residues in your hair and you're not like to finish rinsing off your hair and you find some little some little jargons in your hair it's not beautiful so what do you, what can you do or what do i usually do 
I will go by to do the blending and I'm going to pour it in a cheesecloth. Then, if you do not know what a cheesecloth is, then take a look. That is what a cheesecloth looks like. Or if you do not have a cheesecloth, no worries. No worries. You can use a hand net or a wig net is better. A wig net is better. And you pour in your your mixture in the wig net or your cheesecloth and you just gently squeeze that out. You gently squeeze that out and you're ready to go. So remember that you should always you should always apply your 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 conditioners on a clean scalp after you must have rinsed off your or shampooed your hair or shampooed your hair and you know give it a a good massage so that when you apply the deep conditioner you do not take a lot of time to allow it moisture. So when you apply that from the from the roots of your hair right down to the the how do you call this right down from the roots to the tip of your hair when you apply that from the roots to the tip of your hair you massage your hair again you massage your hair again thoroughly and once you're done you get a plastic bag and you put over you get a plastic bag and you put over and if you want it to generate more heat like what I did I took my my cloth my leggings and I had to double it over my plastic bag so that heat could be generated very fast and after you can leave that you can leave the plastic bag on for 45 to an hour if you if you have quite enough time you could leave it for two hours and more but that that depends on you in a way you can leave that and after 45 minutes or an hour or two hours you can just rinse that off thoroughly with clean warm water you can rinse that off thoroughly with clean warm water
guys we've come to the end of this video and i'm hoping that you guys or you all are going to have an awesome experience with the new routine you're about to implement on your hair you're about to make your hair feel so good you're about to give your hair rich food like never before right okay guys please do not forget if you're a returning subscriber please do not forget to hit the like button and drop a comment in the comment section and also if you are new here please hit the red button subscribe subscribe and also hit the like button and drop a comment in the comment section ask me whatever question you like to know and i'll be right in your inbox to reply to you as soon as possible so guys thank you for watching and thank you for watching to the end god bless you